Firstly, get the equipment needed. Unscrew the screw and pull the handle towards you to unlock the side cover. Put the panel somewhere safe so it doesn't get damaged. Push the two latches to the left so it can access the inside of the computer. This small piece of hardware is the Wi-Fi card we will be removing. You may want to unplug the GPU power connector for the time being, just for some extra working space. Now it's time to open the new Wi-Fi card. Oh, isn't it exciting? Grab your screwdriver and turn the screwdriver anti-clockwise. But be careful, it is not magnetic. You may need some extra help taking the card out, so grab your screwdriver to help you lift the card and slide it out roughly 45 degrees. Wait a minute! The killer card aux and main are opposite from the Intel card. We are still going to put the black on black and white on white as shown. You will know when the cable is connected because you will feel and hear a click. You may want to slide the cables on the side just for some extra working space. Slide the card back in its place and turn the screw clockwise, basically finger tight just to get it nice and snug. Make sure to reconnect the GPU power connector to the board. Time to close the power supply hatch. Turn both latches right to lock the power supply hatch. Reconnect the side panel as shown, roughly 20 to 30 degrees. It should just slide right in there. Screw in the screw to keep the side cover closed. And now, it's time to enjoy some high speed gaming. Oh yeah. If you guys enjoyed today's video, why not leave a like and share the video to someone it may be useful to. If you want to see more videos just like this one, maybe consider subscribing. Alright guys, I'm out. See you on the next one.